In this channel, 13 means luck, and to acquire more of these, get ready to access 13 bedroom decluttering secrets and ingenious DIYs to expose them. From Simp Home, let's engage our first idea. Number 13. Transform your closet with Christie's stylish DIY sliding rod idea. To begin, add a touch of glam by spray painting visible wood screws with copper. Then measure the space from your closet's back wall to the trim and cut a copper pipe accordingly. Smooth the ends with a file. Pop a copper tube cap on the exposed end of the pipe, then mount copper tube straps, spacing them evenly. Slide the pipe in and add washers as spacers if needed. Finally, prevent wall damage by discreetly adding a small screw. Trim the pipe to ensure a perfect fit. Number 12. The Epic IKEA Cabin Bed Plus Desk Cack by Jules Yap First, grab the needed calyx shelving units and assemble 2x4 and 2x2 to create your bed frame sides. Secure them to the wall and each other for rock-solid stability and add Perspex sheets for extra awesomeness. Build the bed frame with timber and slats, connecting it seamlessly to the calyx units. Using sturdy support battens and take it to the next level with a lift-up mechanism powered by gas struts. Desire more versatility? Throw in a removable work table with MDF or IKEA top. 11. A DIY wireless charging nightstand. Create a stylish and functional piece. Start by gluing and joining the elm wood panels with biscuits for rock-solid stability. Shape the wood using a trusty table saw and router table when it's time to deal with the wireless charger. Create a template and carve out a space for the cord. Assemble the main box using tongue and groove joinery, ensuring it's sturdy. Install the wireless charger, grab some 1 8 inch thick plywood to hide it, and adjust your router's depth stop for precise routing to keep the charger charging when needed. Next, build the base using poplar wood, secure it to the main box with dowels, and craft the drawers using elegant dovetail joinery. Later, sand, stain, and seal the wood surfaces for a flawless finish. Number 10. Tired of searching for the perfect bedside table that leaves you with advanced carpentry skills that kill your dream? Then, step 1. Get three sets of wooden boxes, or choose other playful storage options and customize the boxes by painting them or leaving them natural. Step 2. Arrange the boxes to create your desired size and ideal layout, and use the compartments to store items and display accessories if you need them. Optional. Add a reading lamp when needed to repurpose several shelves L brackets to connect the boxes more sturdily or strong neodymium magnets to keep your boxes unharmed. A rope and bramble basket projects. 9. A stylish DIY rope basket idea without sewing. To start, tape the rope end to prevent fraying, then coil the piping tightly, eliminating gaps. Use a trash can as your guide, wrapping and gluing until the coil matches its diameter. Add an extra layer to extend the width by about one. Flip the can and glue the piping to form the basket, avoiding the can itself. Attach leather handles with screw posts, making holes in the basket for insertion. Lift from the bottom to avoid damage and for extra durability, consider stitching the piping. 8. A Bramble Basket Hanging Organizer Idea with Crochet Get ready for a fun and practical DIY to organize your winter gear, dried plants, or closet accessories. Thanks to Chai Wei, already sharing the detail on her blog, all without advanced crochet skills. You'll also find crocheting a triangle instruction and how to fold and seam it to finalize your project. Take wool of the Andes for a cozy, felt, able option or billow yarn for a sturdy and textured look and add extra chic hanging loops to spice up your new crochet storage rack. 7. Transform your closet with an IKEA TroFast closet hack. Start by building a sturdy base, allowing room for a baseboard trim, and attach spacers on the left side for perfect trim coverage. Secure the left side units to the spacers and back wall using brackets. Add more spacers on the right side for trim space, then attach the right side units, screwing them into the left side ones. Complete the look with face frame trim for that polished finish. Fill nail holes and caulk seams and paint the trim to perfection. But wait, there's more! 
Upgrade with Jamie Costiglio's genius DIY closet shoe tray project idea for shoe storage bliss. Measure your closet, attach a sturdy 1x2 cleat, cut a 3 quarter inch plywood ledge, create channels for a pegboard on 1x3 pieces, or attach the pegboard underneath with glue or screws. Assemble the shoe trays and slide them out smoothly with drawer glides. FYI, each tray can hold up to four pairs of shoes. Number six, a new way to store your grooming essentials by DK's Craft. First, print screen three ready-to-follow cut plans in the first 15 seconds of the video. With standard carpentry tools, you'll be gluing, drilling, and screwing your way to a new organization's success. Here, no slider is required. Instead, you will use dowels to connect your pieces, including the mother box, simplifying the process. Regarding the final installation, DK utilizes a French cleat and a French cleat storage wall, adding an extra style touch to the project and the aesthetic value of any small bedroom interior. Ready to dive in? Please check the description. 5. A DIY discreet mini wardrobe idea. Cut a 60 by 200 centimeter panel from MDF. Attach three shelves using universal connectors, first shelf 16 centimeters from the ground, second shelf at 50 centimeters, and third shelf aligned with the panel's top. Next, screw the first closet bar bracket 15 centimeters below the top shelf, then cut a 23 centimeter wardrobe bar. Nail three pads under the vertical panel's base and build the wall placement. Mark shelf and rod positions on the wall using a level. Secure shelves with invisible fixings using screws and dowels. Attach the second rod support, secure shelves to the wall, install the clothes rail, and paint the panel and shelves for a finished look. Additional material. Did you know in 2020, according to NPR.org, approximately 18,000 Americans, primarily children, visited ERs due to injuries caused by furniture, TVs, or appliances tipping over? Therefore, acquire and install wall-mounting hardware whenever you buy a new IKEA wardrobe or from other brands and additional cavity wall anchors. M5 by 52 mm and M5 by 65 mm for plasterboard drywall to double your cabinetry security. At K Nemo provides you with the tip, and you are welcome to support his channel if you find the advice helpful. 4. A Platform Bed Underlayment Project Idea The loft bed is 237 by 107 by 118 centimeters in diameter, and the underbed cupboards provide 60 centimeters depth, offering 46 centimeters of storage or secret hideaways. The pegboard next to the bed is a versatile space for hanging in shelves measuring 205 by 80 centimeters, made from polished pine plywood with a cool matte water-based armored lacquer finish. The project cost close to 2,000 euros to build. Cheaper alternative? Number 3. A mudroom laundry room combo with a pegboard wall from Amrish Maharaj. Picture a bedroom wall adorned with a vibrant pegboard offering endless possibilities to hang coats, bags, and more. Feel the convenience of a bench and storage for your shoes effortlessly blending into a mesh-up mudroom and bed instead of a laundry machine. Imagine a slight hand of a pro carpenter turning that shoe space into a comfy house for a rigid slider bed frame. More expert level transformation plan. 2. Enter Ashcan Mastahim's mind-blowing studio apartment hack. Get ready to be wowed by the ultimate space-transforming experience. Imagine a cozy platform bed that does storage complete with a hidden dining table and seating. Pull out a stylish closet with shelves and a hanging rod for dozens of fabulous wardrobes. The sofa on wheels offers total flexibility. Need a dining area or desk? Roll out the hidden table and grab a tool. And those stairs leading up to the bed? They're sneaky storage drawers with wraparound paneling and hooks to maximize space and style. Lastly, a floating bed project idea with iron tubes from At Home Made Modern. It is simple yet robust, beautiful, and ideal for queen-sized mattress. Forget the massive slab, get a sturdy 1.5-inch steel square tube to ensure perimeter stability. To breezily ease the welding process, use magnetic clamps and use spray paint to skip priming before installing and steel tubes. The hidden legs create a floating illusion, while cantilevers add support.
No need for magnets to make it float. Attach it securely to the wall with a quarter-inch flat bar and create a sleek, flush look. This DIY project is a steel and wood masterpiece, complete with plywood slats and a live-edge cedar headboard. Check the full video to access a kiln-drying wood method crucial for the project. Well, that's it for now. Before you leave this presentation, we'd like to appreciate every second you spend watching this video. If we deserve more of your attention in the future, press the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Like the video if you believe it'll motivate the YouTube algorithm to push the video to more people. Honestly, though, it is more like a myth to us, so feel free to move on with your plan after the video ends. Lastly, we hope you have great luck with your health and project, and we'll see you again soon.